Hi, I'm Eric Lowry. Hey, Eric, I'm Lorna. Nice to meet you. You're going to come in and do the energy audit? I am. Okay, let's get started. I really am excited that you're here and the, we're in the best place to look at the problem area because this addition to our house has really been causing us a lot of uh, coldness this this particular winter. We had it rehabbed about 15 years ago and made into the laundry and the closet and an office and a small bathroom. But it's just so uncomfortable. All of our coats that we keep in the coat closet are frozen in the morning when you come out. So that's <laughs> not good. Why don't we move into your next uh, space here? Okay. The windows uh, in the house were replaced. They were originally steel casement and we had these replaced about 15, 17 years ago. They have leaked the argon and they're now reduced in terms of their yeah, insulation. Yeah, more than likely you've, you've lost some of that. I think the argon is the is kind of the key factor there. Right. So we've talked about replacing them. We haven't gotten around to that, so. Okay, okay. Uh, living room. So is, that a, uh, is that a working fireplace? It is a working fireplace, or presumably, although we have never used it. We have folks in this house with allergies, so we always felt it was best not to start up with it. And if, to our knowledge, the prior owners never used it either. Okay, upstairs. This is a pull-down attic stairs, which I'm happy to pull down for you. Yep. We had blown-in insulation. And we did have one of these oh. magical duct tape. Very, very well, actually, nice. Actually, it's not okay. spray foam. Look at that. Is that fancy or what? It's, uh, well, it's one of the better ones. I've, I've rarely <laughs> ever see anything at all. So, right. Um, not, not bad. They're, they're. Uh, there are probably some other better ways to do it, but that's that's certainly they better say, than a whole lot of nothing. It works. It works. Okay. This is the inner sanctum of the basement. All right, <laughs> which looks uh, actually pretty good. Actually, I've seen plenty, uh, plenty that are not scarier this scarier than this. Oh yeah, a whole uh, lot scarier. Yes, and and many a happy project is uh, left half undone in here. I will spend quite a bit of time down here. Um, I'll look at the ductwork because I noticed this isn't insulated, and it's usually not air sealed. So I'll take a look at that and see kind of how good or bad that is. This is where you're going to yell at me. <laughs> oh my goodness. Yes, I know. Well, I honestly, that looks newer than the one in the kitchen. <laughs> as energy efficient as I'd like people to be, a second <laughs> fridge is a reality. Most, <laughs> lots of people have a second fridge or a second freezer. Um, you know, we have to live our lives. If you don't need this all the time, keep it filled with you know, jugs of water. water Take out. the old mm -hmm. orange juice jug mm -hmm. and fill mm -hmm. it up with water. Keep things in it. That way the fridge will work more Efficient. efficiently. Okay. Um, even though it's an older fridge. Yeah. Okay. <laughs> I'm, I'm open-minded. Essentially, this is just a giant fan. And in a minute, I'm going to turn this fan on and I'm going to depressurize the house. And that's going to accentuate all the air leaks. What I'm going to do is I'm going to go around with the infrared camera and see where we have air leaks. And we also can see puppies. Puppies, uh, are, puppies are always nice sure. and warm. This sees only infrared light. So the lighter colors, the closer to white, the yellows, the oranges are, are warm. Right. And anything that's closer to black, the blues, the purples, the reds are cooler colors. It looks like this little bay window uh, was probably not the top of the ceiling right. of the bay window is probably not insulated. Take a... Oh, the whole room is cold. What a surprise. I like the surface of the wall right there above the door is 45 degrees. Over the door is probably not insulated, which, you know, is, is normal because there wouldn't be any space for insulation there. Certainly parts of that wall are not, are not very yeah. well insulated. This is the crawl space to the office. Ah, uh, okay, okay. I see. Oh, okay. All right. Boy, it is um, bitterly cold in here. There's lots of gaps in insulation, missing in some places. It's uh, certainly not more than a couple of degrees warmer than the outside right now. And uh, electric heat tape wrapped around the exposed water line. Spending money to warm back up the water so the pipes don't freeze. But I think we can offer some solutions to that. 
how do we make out well, here? Well, basically the house is in probably in need of a little insulation and a little air sealing. The heating system looks great. It's, it's relatively new, brand new basically. Do you have any sense about that office? The crawl space under the cold addition over here, it is insulated, but very poorly. Some of the insulation's fallen out. Some of it's, uh, it, was, it was just put in incorrectly. That's probably definitely worth insulating and, and doing some air sealing in there. Uh, insulate the pipes in there so there are some exposed water pipes. Sounds like a plan. Okay, thank you. Thank you.